Good morning. Happy Mother's Day. Hi everyone. Yes, today is Mother's Day. Yeah, I wish all your all the mothers and grandmothers happy Mother's Day. All right. Did you make your craft for your mom? Whatever you made, a card or a craft or flowers. Yeah, I hope all the mothers will like it, whatever you make for them, because your mom is loves you. Yeah. Spotty, you holding my flower. You want to give it to your mom? Oh yeah, okay. So yeah, bring this to your mom, Spotty. <laughs> okay. All right, so ready for our lesson today? Open, shut them, open, shut them, give a little clap, clap, clap. Open, shut them, open, shut them, lay them on your lap, lap, lap. Here is the father. Oops, I need to wash. No, here is the mother. Mother always is number one. Here is the mother. Here is the father. Here is the brother. Here is the sister. Here is the baby. Oh, how God loves them all. Yes. Mother always is number one. Yes, I love my moms. Okay. Go to the songs today. Today's songs, new songs, is related to our Bible story today. Okay. So let's see these songs and I will ask you a simple question after the song. So this song is called With Jesus in the boat. Back here, Spotty, you like the songs? What did you learn? Okay, yes, so in the songs, it's talking about who is in the boat? Jesus, right? Yes, whatever, when Jesus is with us, we don't need to be afraid because Jesus is with us. So we need to trust in Jesus. So no need to be afraid. 
will be happy and smiling, right? Okay, so we no need to worry, smiling, because Jesus is with us. All right, let's go to today's Bible story with teacher Jessie. She's talking about the story is about the songs. Today's story is Jesus Calm the Storm. Hi everyone. Hi Sandy. Hi Wingla. Hi Anson. Hi Jaden. Hi Chloe. Hi Andre. Very excited to see all of you again, especially on Happy Mother's Day. You know, I do believe that all of you had already prepared a special gift for your mothers or already made a Mother's Day card, right? You have, we have to remember our mothers always because they are the very important person in our life. They love us so much. We have to thank him, thank them all the time. Mm -hmm. Now, um, the finger play time. In this house, you will see a happy family. Mm -hmm. There is daddy, there is mother, there is sister, there is both brothers. And who can this one be? Why? This little one is me. Okay, now we have to give prayer to God. Close your eyes. Bow your head, throw your hands. Dear Heavenly Father, thank you so much we can be here to worship you today. We pray that you can um, help the boys and girls they remember their love, their mother's love for them. Help them to remember, always thank them and love their mothers always. And today we pray that you can help all the boys and girls they have good listening ears and learn your words and praising you this morning. In Jesus' name, Amen. Okay, now. So you the pictures. <laughs> now this is Jesus. Remember, the past few weeks we learned about Jesus already back to heaven. But he still uh, continue caring for us. Now I'm going to tell you more about Jesus when he was on earth. So that's why you can know more about him, love him, and trust him. Now this time, you know, uh, you know, uh, when Jesus was on earth, Jesus did a lot of wonderful things. He made sick people well. He made the blind man uh, can see again. And he also told stories to help people understand God's command. We all know that Jesus was the Son of God, right? He was powerful and he was wise too. But Jesus was also a man. Mm -hmm. He was uh, hungry and thirsty at times, just like other people. And he also grew tired like other people. Mm -hmm. Now the day was almost over. Jesus said to his disciple, you see the disciple there, said to the disciple, let's go to uh, across the lake. So Jesus and his disciple, they all got into the boat. And at that time, Jesus was so tired. That's why he lay down in the back of the boat and he fell asleep there. He took a lap. Mm -hmm. You know, once when the disciple and Jesus were in the boat, suddenly a great storm came in, came up. You know, um, the wind began to blow and blow and blow. And then, the, and then it made the waves, you know, the water there, it made the waves get bigger and bigger. And then the water began to splash into the boat wow the wind whip around the disciple the strong wind and the waves up and down up and down rocked the boat too much but jesus at that time he was still slept 
sleeping. Mm -hmm. And the disciple, you can see Jesus was in a deep sleep. <laughs> and the disciple, you know, at that time they were so afraid because of the big waves and the strong wind because it was a storm. Mm -hmm. And then the disciples were so afraid they, they didn't know what to do. And then they, they thought that they were going to die. But they remember that Jesus was special because they was with Jesus before. He healed, a, he healed a sick man. He made a blind man to see again. So that's why at that moment, they thought that maybe Jesus could help them. You know, at that time, the boat was full of water. Everyone was sure that the boat was going to sink. The disciple at that moment, they called out, Wake up, Jesus! Wake up, Jesus! Our teachers, our teachers, wake up! And then they say that the boat is sinking, the boat is sinking. Don't you care, we drown? Don't you care for us? You know, Jesus woke up and then Jesus asked them, Why are you so afraid? Don't you have faith at all? Don't you trust me? Why don't you so afraid? Don't you trust me? After he saying all this to his disciple, then Jesus told the storm to stop. Jesus said to the wind, Stop! And then the wind stopped. Jesus said to the waves, Quiet! Be still! And the waves became still. You know, right away, everything was quiet on the lake. The disciples, they were so amazed. They said to each other, who is this man? Jesus. Even the wind and the waves obey him. Wow, they were so surprised. Who is this man, Jesus? They only knew that he could help the sick man become good again. He could make the blind man to see again. But this time, they saw Jesus. He could ask the wind and the wave to stop. And the wind and the waves obey him. Who is this Jesus was? This is the end of the story. Now it's time for us to answer questions. I have four questions to ask you. The first one, what did Jesus do after he got into the boat? What did Jesus do? Yet, he fell into sleep. He fell into sleep. Mm -hmm. The second question is, why were the disciples so afraid? Why were they so afraid when they were in the boat? Why? Because a storm came up, remember? And then the strong wind and the strong waves rock the boat up and down, up and down. And also, the boat is going to sink, right? Mm -hmm. And the third question, why was Jesus able to calm the storm? Why? Why Jesus could calm the storm? A very challenging question. Because Jesus is the Son of God. Because Jesus is the Son of God. He is all-powerful. Right? Even the wind and the waves obey Him. The fourth question. What did Jesus speak to the wind and the waves? What did He say to the wind and the waves? Yes. Jesus said to the wind, stop, and then the wind stopped. Jesus said to the waves, quiet and be still. 
and then the waves waves became quiet and still wow jesus is so powerful right thank you so much all of you uh, really do know how to answer the questions now is the time for our bible verse the bible verse is even the wind and the waves obey him is from the book of mark chapter 4 verse 41 even the wind and the waves obey him from the book of mark chapter 4 verse 41 that means that jesus is all powerful even the wind and the waves obey him G that means that jesus can bring calm and peace to our lives he can help he's so powerful right now, i'm going to uh, sing the song happy birthday together with the bible words mm -hmm. listen carefully one two three. Even wind and waves obey him. Even wind and waves obey him. Even wind and waves obey him. Mark 4, 41. Wow, it's so wonderful to know that our God is so powerful. Jesus is so powerful. Now, I'm going to sing the songs, Jesus Loves Me, Jesus Loves Me. We know that God is all-powerful. Mm -hmm. He sent Jesus to us to know how great God is. Okay, now, we know that Jesus, from the, from the Bible, we know that Jesus is the Son of God. He is all-powerful. He is always with us. We should not be feared. Okay, now we sing, Jesus loves me, Jesus loves me. Clapping your hands when we sing, Jesus loves me, Jesus loves me. Jesus loves me, Jesus loves me. He is always, always near. If I do but love and trust Him, there is nothing I need fear. We know that. Jesus is all powerful. When we, you know, He can help us and bring calm and peace to our life. When we have troubles, He will do it because He, he is all powerful. This time we're tapping our hands when we sing, Jesus loves me, Jesus loves me. Okay? Jesus loves me, Jesus loves me. He is always, always near. If I do but love and trust Him, there is nothing I need fear. We know that Jesus is all powerful. He watch over us day and night. He always can keep us safe so we can trust and obey Him. This time, show me your Bible hand. One, two, three. Trust and obey. For there's no other way to be happy in Jesus, but to trust and obey. We know that Jesus loves us. He listens to our prayers. He never leaves us so we can trust and obey Him. Huh? This time, pray ahead. Ready? One, two, three. Trust and obey. For there's no other way to be happy in Jesus, but to trust and obey. We know that Jesus is all-powerful. He can bring peace and calm to our lives. We can give prayer to Him and ask Him to help. Okay? See you next week. Thank you for worship with me this morning. See you next time. Bye-bye. Okay, thank you, Teacher Jesse, for the Bible story. Yes, yeah, so the story is talking about Jesus. Is it Jesus doesn't care? No, because once Jesus is with us, we need to trust in Him. Jesus is care about us. We don't need to be afraid. We just need to trust. All right, so... Today's craft 
is very related to the Bible story. I want to make Jesus calm the storm. All right, so what is this? Let's see. So here is, right, the disciples and Jesus is in the boat and then on the sea. Right, so suddenly the storm is coming. Whoa, big wind and storm and rain, right? So the disciples is ask Jesus, Jesus, wake up, wake up. What we should do? So they're very afraid. But when Jesus wake up and then ask the storm, stop. He just said stop and then the storm is stop and sun is coming out wow jesus really have the power so when jesus with us we don't need to be afraid okay all right so let's make this one together hello okay my craft table yes today we're gonna make this about the bible story today is jesus calm the storm right so this is the bowl in the sea here is the storm but when jesus says stop and then it become sunny again all right so well okay let's make this together all right of course you need the bottom construction paper you can find a little hard one and then about the sky um like about that thick so you need to fold about the sky thick okay. Here. That. okay so then you can put glue Here's the sky. And in the sky, you see I have sunny day, I have sun, prepare the sun. And well, sometimes you see the cloud. then do the inside first so it look like inside this have to storm okay so usually you see the storm or rain with black sky great so prepare the black cow and 
and also if you see the the storm thunderstorm you see some lightning right so you can make this Then you will see the the rain. So you can draw some, but try to when you cover, try to don't see it. Then you will know can tell the difference. Don't show it. Yeah. So it's about here. So you can put some rain to here. right so it's like that so cover yeah you don't see it okay good all right next step is for the the C or you can make the bow first all right make the bow first so prepare the bow and if you have um, stick popsicle stick or you if you don't you can use um, straw all right so and then I prepare like this my sample is just the triangle but I create um, people the disciples and Jesus on the bowl so you can draw your own if you like if you doesn't want to it's okay so then I glue that on the bowl on the bow and then you can glue the bow on the stick put it on side let it dry all right then we make the C all right of course you prepare blue color so I have two layer so you can slide in the bowl like that so the um, the bottom so it's about like that Some high. And then you can make some wave shape.
then you can glue it this is the the bottom one I want to make it in a layer so this is the bottom one so the bottom one you need to glue on it the whole thing it looks like the sea and then the top one This is the top one. The top one, no need to glue. Find a stapler. Okay, so stapler both side on a side like that. All right. So in here, your bow is ready. And then you can slide in. So it's like Jesus with the disciples on the sea. Oh, there's a storm. No, Jesus, wake up. So Jesus tell the wind and the storm stop so everything clear very nice yeah so <laughs> all right so done the crafts hope you guys enjoy this craft all right back here okay well hope you guys like the craft well you can play with it all right or you can use this to tell the bible story to others as a um a a a pops or, or visual to to show um to others all right okay all right before we leave we sing this songs jesus loves me yes jesus loves us jesus loves you jesus loves everyone and also mother's day i love my moms my moms love you too it's like jesus loves us okay all right so very familiar song and hand motion i hope you should remember because we sang it long time ago and very familiar this song okay let's do this song sing this song together remember jesus how to do it yeah the fingers pointing to the palm because Jesus nailed on the cross. So this is represent Jesus. All right. Let's sing this song once, okay? One, two, three. Jesus loves me, this I know. For the Bible tells me so. Little ones to him belong. They are weak, but he is strong. Yes, Jesus loves me. Yes, Jesus loves me. Yes, Jesus loves me. The Bible tells me so. Very good. All right. Okay. Let's ready to say goodbye and you guys can have time with your mom all right this is my craft oh yeah i draw i make this with jesus and the disciples Ooh, this is cute yeah all right so hope you guys enjoy today's lesson and you have a good time with your mom with your family okay happy mother's day i'll see you guys next week stay safe bye bye